Yardy said to the sisters in the chat, please don't become a baby mama. Don't. Don't disqualify yourself in the full of dating market. Young ladies, if you're watching and you're not a baby mama yet, rest your front. Protect your womb. Do not, do not, do not become a baby mama. Rest your front. Rest your brain. Rest your body. We live in a culture and a community where baby mama ism is just something we do as black women. And I'm not talking about American black women. We know the stats. What they say, 85% of um, kids born in Jamaica are from single moms. So calm down. This is not an American thing. Men of value in all cultures want unused womb. They're going to hear we talk about unused womb. And, and come over here triggered about how many abortions we have. But it doesn't change the fact, as Yardley said, do not become a baby mama. You can control it. You can control if you are a baby mama or not. There are so many forms of contraceptives out there. It is not rocket science. ZH in the building. ZH asked if she could do a stream with me a couple months now going over how to, to track your fertility so you do not get pregnant. It is not rocket science. Just don't become a baby mama. It is that simple. If you don't want to be out here bitter as ever because you, you, you're 25 but you're looking like 40 because you're bitter, don't become a baby mama. I say this time and time again and hate me if you must and, and come for me if you must if your favorite content creator is a baby mama. Point out where I lie though. We have these female content creators being the head of the conversation, being the femininity of the culture, being the ones who want to save the community, but you a baby mama? I said what I said. Why the hell of the conversation the baby mamas will have panels full of baby mamas every single one of them up there are baby mamas but they're the one who thinking that they should gatekeep the, con the conversation the baby mamas are the one who thinking that they have the the word the say who is allowed to have the conversation the baby mamas taking over the manosphere y'all make it make sense i'm just trying to have the conversation oh my god the ghetto. the ghetto like come on man no disrespect but why are baby mamas the ones leading these conversations baby mamas are the ones leading the conversation how we can repair the black community and they're not telling young ladies to rest your front no i could i could tolerate a baby mama leading the conversation if every other word she said was young ladies do not get pregnant if she tattooed Yardley's comment on her forehead, where is it? If she, if she would tattoo Yardley's comment, don't become a baby mama on her forehead whenever she's having these conversations, then I could listen to her. But why are the women who directly contributed to the downfall of the black community the ones having the conversation about the black community being trash and they're mainly pointing fingers at black men? Black men can't be that much of trash if y'all keep on getting pregnant for them. Y'all constantly getting pregnant for them, but at the same time, always saying that they're trash. Like, make it make sense. The math is not mathing. When you put two and two together and you get a minus one, what are you supposed to get? Two plus two is four. Minus one, that's three quick maths.